Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to another video on InRange TV. Today, we're going to be putting a Spencer in the infamous wheelbarrow of mud. Uh, Carl thinks that this will actually run okay because it has pretty much a sealed up action when it's closed, which is what we have found to be the basically the requirement for a gun to run well in this. I am not so sure. I'm pretty dubious that this will make it through more than a couple rounds at most. So I'm loading seven. That's the full capacity of the mag. Put that in there. And then we will go ahead and chamber around, but leave the hammer down. You want to fire one just proving that it works? Oh, I probably should. Pew! It works. Now, and we have a round going into the chamber. Hammer is down. Let's go ahead and mud it up. So I suspect we will get enough little bits of water and crap in this mechanism that uh, it won't work so hot. There's no need to mess with the front or the back. You think that's enough? Flip it to the other side just for, yeah. Get some more on there. All right. Should I get the trigger? Yeah. All right. That's pretty bad. That's a pretty thorough coating of mud. All right. Let's see if it works. Firing pin appears to be clear because the hammer was down. All right, so it fires one. Now, let's see, why don't I cycle it and then run the hammer? All right, there is something blocking this. I think it is mud right there on the breech face. Can you see that? Yep. That, yep, that's what the breech block's hitting. And with the breech block hitting that, it can't uh, go all the way forward and then lock upward into the receiver here. And now, let's see, maybe if I pop that one out, see if I can carefully wipe that clean. All right, let's try that. Better. Oof. There's still a little bit of gook down in the bottom. Can you see that down in there? Maybe. Yeah. Right down in that yeah, corner. I see it. Yeah, it's right next to the cartridge room. And oh, and of... you know what? We've also got some mud in the breech face. Or on the breech face right down in there. Yep. And that, I don't think I can really... I have no way to wipe that out with a finger. Uh, should we try running some water into it? Yes. Got some of it. I got more of it. I don't think it's quite all out. I'm gonna go ahead and lose this round too. Wipe that down with a finger. That might do it. You ready? Mm. Awesome, now it's completely. All right, so I have washed mud somewhere more important into the action. And now I can't. You know, it's interesting. We found that in the past where sometimes putting water on it actually can make it worse. It really does. Yeah, yeah it gets mud out of the place where, uh, where it is at the moment and it washes it deeper into the action where it's actually worse for you. So, unless you object, I'm gonna call this here. Uh, I think we have a consensus that this Get one round, you try and cycle this thing, it looks like a closed action, but there's just enough space in there that little bits of grit and dirt and clay, if we had any clay in this, can get down inside and prevent it from from working. Mm. Uh, my apologies to this gorgeous Spencer rifle, but I think it'll clean up okay. If you enjoy seeing this sort of thing, please do consider checking us out on Patreon. We are an entirely viewer-funded channel and project. Uh, it's all, all from your Patreon support that we can pick up something like this Spencer, put it through the mud test, and bring the results to you.
Thanks for watching.